Hey there, everybody. In this episode, we're going to show you how to email your website that you've made for school to at least a parent, uh, at least one of your parents, your teacher, and make sure the portfolio is on there and all that. Okay. So in one of the last videos that's up in these directions right here, uh, we've got like how to create a portfolio, how to create a website. And now we're down here to writing an email. All right. Mr. Johnson has a great video on how to write an uh, an email, we're going to go along with that, but add in a couple things. So first of all, with your website, okay, if you made any changes, um, oh, sorry, if you made any changes or anything, make sure that you hit publish and like your old published stuff will be here, your new stuff's here, you hit publish so that your website is totally up to date. Okay. Last thing you're, or next thing you're going to do is you're going to hit this chain right here, copy that link and paste it into another web browser that is not this. So try Safari, try emailing it to yourself. If you only have like Safari on your phone, email it to yourself, make sure that it works. Firefox, um, Microsoft Edge, whatever is not this so that you can see if anything is hidden or blocked or access is denied, things like that. After you do that, and it passes and everything works, now we're gonna email it to at least a parent and a teacher. So you're gonna open up your Gmail and in the two box, you're gonna type in one of your parents' emails and in the CC box or carbon copy, you're gonna type in your teacher's name. So if your teacher is Ms. Hobbled, you write Ms. Hobbled. If it's, if it's me, you can write me, one of the other teachers. For the subject line, you can call it my website with portfolio. We always want to have a greeting. So you could say, good afternoon, good morning, mom, dad, Miss Hop, you know, whoever the teacher is. And then you could write a little message like this on there. And now we want to add the link. So we're going to go back to our website. We're going to grab this chain thing right here. We're going to copy that link again. We are on our homepage. Please, please, please be on your homepage. If you're not on your homepage, click on homepage and then click this again to copy your link. And then we're going to go to our website here. We're going to say like this part right here where it says, here's a link. Yeah, let's, let's make that a link. So we click on what just happened. We click on this right, highlight the area. We hit insert, we hit paste or control V. And then I always encourage you to test the link before you ever, ever send an email, ever send an email, start practicing now in high school, test the link, make sure it works, hit okay. And then you need like an outro, right? Like, I hope you're having a good day, looking forward to spending the weekend, whatever it is, have a nice outro put there, hit send, boom, you are done. Thank you so much for watching. And if you have any questions, let me know.